Have you ever found yourself putting together a permanent or a temporary electrical assembly and thinking, I wish this had this device or that feature, then this would be the perfect bit of kit. Well, if you have, then this is the perfect bit of kit. It's the top toe range from Luden, a new way of installing socket outlets into industrial environments, although it has lots of other applications, including a perfect solution for supplies to caravan pitches. It's endlessly adaptable, flexible, and adjustable. Now, the thing I love about this product is the modularity of it. Think of it as the Lego of the electrical world, where you can put together lots of different components to come up with something tailored to meet your specific needs. The enclosures are available in this windowed version, which can incorporate circuit protection, or in this version, where several socket outlets can be connected up. And both of these enclosures come in different sizes. The enclosures are rated at IP66 and 67, which makes them suitable for pretty serious environments. Now this is the top tur range, so we'll start from the top down. Often with IP67 rated enclosures, you can break a nail trying to open the lids up. But the windowed enclosure has this beautiful opening mechanism. Now when we first encountered this top tur system, our publisher here at eFix absolutely fell in love with this feature. And I'm sure you'll agree, that is some lovely engineering. But the best thing about it is that it makes the lid lockable, so it gives us an added safety feature. Now there's a subtle difference between the two front plates on these windowed enclosures. This one has two gang spaces for outlets to be installed, and this one has single gang outlets. Now as you can see from the examples here, there is a huge array of different outlets available. Just as a bare sampling as examples, you've got a three-phase and neutral 32 amp with an interlocking isolator, a 13 amp BS1363 outlet. Under this clear cover, you've got data outlets, then this absolute beast of a 63 amp outlet and a 16 amp outlet with an interlocking isolator. And again, just looking at that adaptability, this socket is rated at IP44, which may be all that's required in certain environments. Moving over to the other enclosure, we've got a few more options. We've got a 110 volt IP44 outlet there, then a blank plate should it be required, a 16 amp single phase plug that could act as a connection point for this panel to power it up. Then there's this different feature here, a two gang switch with retractive switching. Along the bottom row here, there's a 16 amp single phase socket outlet in the XCEE style with an interlocking rotary switch built into the base. Then another 13 amp BS1363 outlet that maintains the IP rating when a plug is connected. And finally, a 16 amp single phase socket outlet and a 32 amp three phase and neutral socket outlet. Now this doesn't cover the full range of outlets, switches and accessories that are available as part of this endlessly flexible and adaptable electrical assembly. Now these have just been put together as samples of what's available and one particular arrangement may not meet your needs. So Luden provide over 80 different variants on this theme with different layouts, different outlets and different positions of items. But if one of those over 80 different layouts doesn't meet your requirements, the good news is that as we've already said, this range is like the Lego of the electrical industry. It can all fit together in lots of different ways to produce lots of different outcomes. So you can contact Luden, tell them what your requirements are, exactly what you want, and they will put it together for you. It all comes pre-wired internally with your required protection in place. It really will be able to meet almost any need that you can think of. So that's a good overview of the range. Let's look at the inside of one of these assemblies in a little more detail. On most of the windowed enclosures like this one, the lid of the fitting is hinged. Now I'm sure that we've all been there before when installing enclosures with wired fronts, the front here often gets left hanging by its conductors and ends up banging against the wall, getting scuffed and scratched. So the hinge keeps that from happening. And it also prevents strain on the conductors. As we said previously, it's IP66 and 67 rated, and you can see around the edge here the gasket that maintains that rating. Just a word on fixings as well, there's the option to drill through the back and fix through these specific holes, and then install the provided covers for those fixings. But if you're a bit like me and a bit paranoid about maintaining IP ratings, the enclosures have these keyhole fixings on the back, meaning you don't have to drill a fixing hole. So, in the example that we've got on the wall here, we're going to bring our cable in and feed the main switch. And we'll bring our CPC connection to this DIN rail mounted terminal. Then the tri-rated cables take care of the rest of the wiring. It couldn't be simpler or quicker for the electrician to install. And the quality is just inherent through the product. You can see all of the flexible conductors have ferrule crimps on the ends of them. And here at eFix, we love a ferrule. 
Now, just looking at the buzz bar along the top here, we've got a couple of MCBs, one for each socket, and two RCCBs, again, one for each socket should it be needed. Look at how much room there is in here to bring your cables in and connect up your conductors. There's no wrestling cables into tiny spaces here. So I'm sure you'd agree, this is a really well thought out system with lots of nice features and details that will make electricians' lives easier. And we like that. But remember that key advantage. There's over 80 different off-the-shelf arrangements available. If you come up with a new arrangement, the top tier system can be made up to what you need. So it's fair to say, if you want your installation to be top-notch without costing top dollar, it's just got to be top tier. Thank you very much for watching.